Vegas, so back in the kitchen with Paul Brands. We are going to make some sponge toffee now. Yes. Which I'm so excited about. Yes. Uh, you know, fairly easy process. Fairly easy and great if you got kids because um, they love it. It's a bit of science, right? Ooh, look at that. Oh, so, so get them actually sugar. help in yeah, the creating absolutely. all yep. of it. So we're going to just all it is is sugar. Uh huh. Um, Do you need a spoon? Sugar, corn nice syrup. If you want to pour that water in the jug in here as well. You got it. So you start with a fairly hot, yeah, hot pot. And then going. all you're going to do is you're going to stir it um, till the sugar dissolves. Can I stir it with this? Yeah, sure. Okay. Just stir it around, and you're going to um, keep stirring till it dissolves. And then you're going to use one of these, which is a sugar thermometer. Okay. There's um, a special thermometer just for sugar. There is. Okay. Yes. Because, I did I mean, not you know that. You couldn't really kind of prove this into a piece of meat. It would be um, it would be a little hard. That would not And work. you'd end up with a big hole in your roast. Um, <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> this is a meat thermometer. This is a sugar thermometer. Yeah. Um, actually, I got this from my sister because uh, she was buying a thermometer and um, she was like, what's hard crack? And I said, a bit like your roast. Um, but <clears throat> so I've got lots of these from, there's a, there, there's a whole club out there of that. I've got about four of them at home from friends who have done the same thing. Right. So, um, <laughs> anyway, so when that dissolves, yes. we basically uh, get it to it where it's like a nice like thick syrup. So you, and it's bubbling. Bubbling away. Okay. Right? Very hot. So you don't want to make sure that you don't burn yourself. We basically want it to go to 300 degrees, which is called a hard crack. Okay. Okay, so you put your thermometer in. If you put get your up thermometer to in, you get it to 300, which this will be. Uh, you want to add your vanilla. You take it off the heat at that point. Mmm, fresh vanilla. Yep, this is vanilla paste. You can use vanilla extract paste. if you want, um, or a fresh vanilla uh, pod and just scrape it. That's yep. fine too. Okay. Lovely. So you just stir that in. And is is the whole point here? Like, do you have to keep going pretty fast on this so it doesn't set on you? Yeah. Well, this is the next thing. You're gonna add the baking soda. Okay. So this is the key. Yep. Once you get up to what do you call it again? The 300. 300, 300 degrees. Hard crack. Hard hard crack. So um, why does that sound so <laughs> wrong? <laughs> <laughs> like you have to be in crack, rehab people. for for doing this. <laughs> so then it's swelling up. Um, look what you've done. And that's what um, you want it to do, that's right? That's what you want it to do. And okay. then you pour it out. So as soon as it starts to rise, and look at it, it keeps on growing. Yeah, it is. I'm actually a little bit scared, but it's supposed to do that. <laughs> it's supposed to do that, and that's your sponge toffee. Okay. And that's it. So and how long it. do you keep it there for to cool down? You it do that take, overnight? Uh, no, no, no. It takes about it takes about 20 minutes to cool down, and then okay. you get you get this. Right. And just put it on a piece. This is parchment paper uh -huh. with a bit of maybe some Pam or, or no, it won't stick. Okay. And then you've got this. It's cooled now, so it's all hard. Yeah. So we gave it some time. Oh, that's really it's hard. hard. We've got a nice little frisbee. What going I'm going to do here. is give you a palette knife. Okay. I'm going to pour some chocolate. Yes. And then all you do is just spread. Because we're actually going to make um, we're going to make sponge toffee bark. So you've got the sponge toffee on the inside. You've got this chocolate all around, all around on the top and the. Well, can you do the other side? You can. You got to wait till it hardens. Okay. This is tempered chocolate, and I know people working with chocolate they they get very scared when they talk about tempered <laughs> Not chocolate. Me. But basically, tempered chocolate is basically you are melting the chocolate to yeah. a higher temperature, cooling it down, and then bring it back up. And basically, it's it's a higher melting point. That's all got you're doing, it. really. Okay, okay, so this is the final thing. And then this is the final. We've done, because of Christmas, we've uh, yeah. crushed some candy canes or pistachios um, or uh, salted pretzels. Very um, nice. And literally, all you have to do is, I'll just get a, is just get a knife and crack it up. And, and you can give up. that to, you can give that to some of your guests as party favors yeah. even. Yeah, absolutely. Like I love receiving that sort of stuff yeah. for the holidays. So after the show, thanks so much to Chef Brands, you are all going to get some sponge toffee. Aren't you lucky? <laughs> We're we'll be rude not to.